Hello Potterheads, welcome back to our channel. On April 12th, 2023, the first ever Harry Potter TV show was announced to be coming to Max, which you might remember as HBO Max. As you can imagine, every tiny detail about our favorite wizard's return is being eagerly followed by fans everywhere. For those who might not know, Harry Potter is a seven book series by JK Rowling. It's not just a series of books though. It's a massive franchise that includes spin-offs, movies, plays, video games, theme parks, and so much more. The story is loved by people of all ages, and while the magical world of Harry Potter has grown beyond the original books, nothing has managed to top the captivating tale of the original series. The story follows Harry Potter, a young wizard as he explores the magical school of Hogwarts, learns about magic, and faces off against the dark wizard, Lord Voldemort. Now we've already seen Harry Potter on the big screen, in an eight-part movie series starring Daniel Radcliffe as Harry, Emma Watson as Hermione Granger, and Rupert Grint as Ron Weasley. These movies were huge box office successes and paved the way for the franchise universe we know today. But as with all book-to-movie adaptations, there were scenes and characters that didn't make the cut. That's where the HBO Max Harry Potter TV show comes in. It gives the series the length required to fully capture the breadth of the novels. Given HBO's track record of adaptations, Max seems like an excellent landing spot for the beloved series. Every announcement about the upcoming Harry Potter reboot is sure to generate excitement. Since the announcement, original Harry actor Daniel Radcliffe has been bombarded with questions about his feelings regarding the reboot. In an interview with Variety, Radcliffe stated that he hoped the Harry Potter TV show would satiate fans who were disappointed with the movies. He said, I'm excited for it as a viewer. I'll be able to enjoy it with everyone else, possibly, with a slightly different perspective. It's a nice thing that a whole new generation is going to get introduced to the series in a new way. That's why they're doing it as a TV series, would be right. to have more time to tell those stories. So um, yeah, I guess for anyone that was, was mad we cut stuff, uh, this is they will be able to get <laughs> HBO does indeed have an obligation to expand on the plot for the Harry Potter TV shows. You must be very brave. While it's understandable that certain storylines from the books had to be cut for time, some of these cuts reduced the impact of key reveals and robbed side characters of triumphant arcs. Hopefully, the Harry Potter TV show will include all of the plot threads and more. With a tweet posted from HBO Max on April 12, 2023, fans can celebrate the official confirmation that Harry Potter TV show is in production. In the short video shared by HBO, the magical floating candles that illuminate Hogwarts Great Hall in the movies appear and move around to spell out Harry Potter in the memorable lightning-like font of the series. Now you might be wondering about the release date. HBO rarely rushes its television shows, even when it comes to popular franchises. For example, there were three years between the final of Game of Thrones and the premiere of House of the Dragon. So, if the series follows a similar production schedule, Harry Potter fans will have to wait. So rude. However, this could mean the show might have a serendipity of premiering in 2027, exactly three decades after the release of the series' debut novel, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. As for the cast, there have not been any announcements yet, but there is sure to be plenty of speculation about who will be recast in the Harry Potter remake. The movies consistently cast legendary English actors, so there will certainly be some notable names appearing in the show. While there haven't been many Harry Potter TV show updates, arguably the biggest question on the viewers' minds has been answered. Though the show is a complete reboot and totally unrelated to the blockbuster movie franchise, Many in the Harry Potter fandom still want to see Daniel Radcliffe in the series. Unfortunately, Radcliffe gave a definitive no about returning, but stated that he was very excited to see what the new Harry Potter TV show cast would be doing. While the advent of the new Harry Potter TV show is an exciting prospect, there's no question that the HBO Harry Potter recast challenge is probably one of the series' greatest. The characters that J.K. Rowling has created in the Wizarding World franchise are more than simply beloved and several notable figures from the series have added some considerable pressure to the mix. The Harry Potter movies are giant successes and serve as relatively faithful adaptations of the source material. However, a television show can offer much more time to explore supporting characters, flesh out the main ones, and depict fan-favorite scenes from the books that could not be shown in the films. The Harry Potter TV show will have a chance to fix some mistakes of the Harry Potter movies, 
While a series can make time for those things, it has not been announced how many seasons Max's Harry Potter TV show will be. But a good guess is that each session will depict one book. This would make the most sense, given how each book depicts one year of Harry's life. So Potterheads, get ready for a magical journey as we wait for more updates on this exciting new show. Until then, Mischief Managed.